I've been fortunate to be a participant or active member of a lot of different communities, using it in that sense of partly the imaginary, uh, partly based on identity and things like that. But I can also say that as an artist and as a performing artist and as a music maker and as a collaborator, I've found myself involved with a lot of musical communings, <laughs> you know, a lot of different collaborative moments where we find ways to build together despite whatever might appear to be ostensible differences. So I guess maybe these, both of these senses of the term are being brought forth in this version of the festival because I'm trying to work from what I know and from whom I know and in a very real sense of uh, people I've worked with for decades, you know, or people who have impacted my life for that long, for 10 or 15 or 20 or 25 years, <laughs> it cuts a pretty wide swath. I've collaborated over the years with many pioneering elder African-American musicians. One of them is George Lewis, the brilliant, incredible composer, theorist, philosopher, <laughs> musicologist, and improviser. And he introduced me to this incredible community of like-minded artists uh, because he was a part of the Association for the Advancement of Creative Musicians, which was a movement basically formed by a group of artists, musicians on the south side of Chicago in the 60s. They were all African-American and they were all really wide-ranging in their interests. They all have very individual and uh, idiosyncratic persona as composers and as performers. And they've all made a lot of collaborative music. And so in a way, not only are they composers, but they have also kind of decentered the idea of composition through tapping into different improvisational disciplines and connecting to other musical histories. So that's had a huge influence on me over the last 20 something years. And because of that, I've gotten to work for more than a decade with the incredible trumpet player and composer Wadada Leo Smith, whom I'll be playing in duo with. I also got to work for some years with the incredible multi-instrumentalist virtuoso Roscoe Mitchell, who will be working with George Lewis and one of the founders, Muhal Richard Abrams, who's a huge influence on me and whom I've known for 20 years, you know. So that's a big part of the story. And George's opera, which is actually in some ways depicting this history, is one of the centerpieces of the festival. It's being performed on Friday night. It's called the Afterward. So that's one of the threads, I guess you could say, is this sort of, um, let's call it a tradition of black experimentalism. That's part of the fabric of American music and uh, improvised music as we know it today. 